Hello, in this video we are going to show you how to create a countdown for your website. From plugin menu click manage countdowns. By default you have a countdown already created so uh, you can uh, start using this one or you can uh, create a new one uh, by clicking uh, this button. For this demo we'll uh, start using the already defined uh, countdown. You have uh, countdown settings, uh, background playlist, social channels, delete, duplicate and preview. Uh, these actions are available for uh, all uh, countdowns. In uh, settings you have uh, general settings. You can uh, define the begin and end date of your uh, countdown. So uh, the day when you started to work on your uh, project and uh, the, the date when uh, the project will be available uh, to the public. Uh, you have uh, parameters for uh, days circle. Uh, the same for hours, uh, minutes, seconds. You have parameters for H tags and P tags and uh, for uh, background settings. Please note that uh, you have uh, default values for these uh, uh, variables. So uh, you'll only modify them uh, if you want uh, different values from uh, from the standard ones. Uh, in uh, background playlist you'll, uh, you can add your uh, image uh, or video background. F we'll start to add some uh, image backgrounds. No, uh, click add record. We'll add a new one. The same select from media library and uh, click add record. Now let's go back to the playlist. Uh, you have the option to delete duplicate uh, um, a background item. Also you can uh, change uh, the parameters. Uh, to rearrange them just uh, use drag and drop and the order will be changed. Now let's preview the countdown. Uh, in uh, Manage Countdowns we'll go to Social uh, Channels. We'll uh, add um, an image. We'll select uh, Twitter. You can um, <coughs> add your link here. Also, uh, the image title. Now add record. Let's add a second one. Let's say um, Facebook. and again uh, write the uh, image title. Back to the social channels list uh, and we'll uh, preview the, the countdown. Here you have the, uh, the social channels. You can add a pattern over the uh, the countdown uh, so uh, the images will be uh, uh, faded. Uh, we'll go to manage countdowns and uh, countdown settings and here you have uh, uh, in background settings you have a uh, texture path. Now uh, in, uh, in, uh, we've uh, uploaded in uh, media library this one. You can find uh, already created four uh, patterns. 
in uh, the resources folder. Now we'll select this one, update and uh, preview. And as you can see, uh, the pattern has been added uh, over the, the images. Uh, if you are not logged in, you can uh, see how your uh, website will uh, look like. That's it.